Hey, what's going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another episode of Benny Rodriguez's Road to the Show here on MLB 15 The Show. As you guys can see now, we are hitting at the top of the lineup out of the first slot. They moved us up from, I think we were at eighth all the way up to first, so that's pretty cool. Hitting lead off here for the first time. We're gonna see what we can do here at the top of the order. Maybe we'll have more opportunities to score more runs, and we'll definitely have more opportunities to potentially steal bases, especially if we get that hit at the beginning of the game. We'll be the first person on, so we can definitely steal then. So let's get things started here against the Arkansas Travelers here on the road in this one. Starting off again at the leadoff position. Oh, we're swinging and missing at that 93 mile per hour fastball. That one should have been one that I should have been able to drive. I think I was just a little bit late on that one. Second pitch of the at-bat way outside. Very easy to hold off on that one, thankfully. And as you guys can see there, I, I love how they have that little weather indications there. It's kind of cool because then you know where you want to be able to pull the ball. And there we go, guys, our first hit hitting out of the leadoff spot. And now we're going to have an opportunity here to potentially swipe a bag. So let's see what happens here. Again, I got picked off in my last game by being a dumbass and not going back to the base. And this time we are going to have an opportunity to take off. But it was just a weird hit by my uh, by the player at the plate. And we actually did not get a steal for that. That would have been an easy steal, though. I'm telling you, we got a good jump on that one. But anyway, uh, ended up getting to second. Now we're going to try and play here in the field. Oh, we bobbled that one I got in, in the place for it and he just didn't make the play I guess he, uh, we definitely need to improve on our fielding attributes because I don't think there's really much more that I could have done here I mean we were right on top of it that should have been an easy play uh, we still almost got him out just by throwing it actually but um, he was still getting gonna get there on time so Unfortunately, we start this game off not in a very good situation in the field, but we're gonna make up for it right here Benny the jet throwing over to first. Oh never mind <laughs> <laughs> Two errors in the field, guys. Are you kidding me? Oh, no. Oh, we're playing so bad. We got to make up for it at the plate, man. We definitely are going to have to make up for it. That was just embarrassing. Two errors already in this game. We're in the third inning. That's not good. Thankfully, they didn't get any runs out of those errors, but still, it's embarrassing. I think that's our third error we've already had here. And we're going to drive this thing out to deep right field, but it is not going to go for a home run. Easy fly ball there for the right fielder. So we're now one for one, or one for two, excuse me, in this game. Got to try and make sure that we're getting hits here because, uh, yeah, you can definitely tell this is a close game right now. Very, very close as we line this one foul. Again, two to zero. We absolutely have to get on here. We're down two runs. And it's all going to come up to whether we can get hits or not. And we are going to drive this one again. Deep right field. Will the right fielder make the play? No, he misses it. Jumping for it. And we are going to get in here with an easy double. I don't even need to slide, but I did anyway just for some style points right there. Benny the Jet now with a, a single and a double in this one. Getting into scoring position. That is the same fielder who made that just terrible play in the last game, if you guys recall that, uh, at the end of that game. So it's kind of funny that it happened again where the ball just went right over his head. And we are going to try and steal third here. Are we going to get in? I thought that I got thrown out. We got a poor jump on it, but we still swiped third. So we do get at least a stolen base here. I, at first, I thought for sure that I was going to get thrown out with that poor jump. You could just tell when I took off that I did not get a good jump. But thankfully, we slid right around that tag. A beautiful slide there by the Jet. And we unfortunately are still down 1-2 to two here in the top of the 7th. 91 pitches by this starting pitcher right now. This is a clutch situation here. If we can get a home run, we can tie this game, or at least if we can get into scoring position with maybe another double. We're going to line this thing out again to deep right field, and it goes over the right fielder's head again. Another double. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in scoring position yet again with another extra base hit. That's two doubles and a single here for the Jet. And we, guys, we are the only one really producing anything at the plate right now for the team. So thankfully, we are able to do that at least. And we did eventually score that run there. So it is 2-2 two two here in the top of the ninth. This is a huge opportunity here. We could potentially win this game with a run scored. Again, two out here. So we probably are going to need to get a double or at least get a single and then steal second if we want to. Ugh. And we ground out. Ugly grounder. I'm still going to dive in there at first base to try and make it on time. I know diving to first base makes no sense. But I do it anyways for the fun. You know what I'm saying? Now, here we go in the field. I am trying to turn a double play here. And for some reason, he just didn't throw the ball. I don't know what the hell happened there. 
thankfully, it didn't really matter because they weren't able to score a run and we did get at least one out. But man, that should have been an easy double play. I don't, I don't know why the, the throwing indicator came up. I pressed the button and he just didn't throw the ball. I don't know. Maybe you guys can let me know if there's some weird thing that sometimes happens or maybe I pressed the wrong thing or something. And right here, guys, we are batting just terribly in the 11th inning in a clutch situation with a man on second. If we single here, we could potentially walk away with a win. 1-1 one, one count here. Can we walk away and be the hero in this game? Big opportunity and, oh, man, what am I doing swinging at that? The thing almost hit me in the head. It was so high. Are you kidding me? Oh, the batting eye right now for me is just terrible. Thankfully, we did hold off on that one, and the runner is now going to get to third on that terrible throw. So now, again, it gives us even a better opportunity here. All we need is a simple single. We can probably even almost bunt our way on here, but we're not going to go for that. We're not quite confident in our bunting skills yet at this point, and we're hitting pretty well. 2-2 two, two count here with a man on third. Tie game here in the top of the 11. Benny the Jet up, and he is going to swing and miss. Oh, gosh, the choke job is real, the Jet. Oh, the clutch batting just was not there. We do end up walking away with a loss in this game. 3-2, 14 hits, and we only scored two runs. I did have both those errors, too, by the way. Now, in this game, I actually did un unlock a new item. It was called the Lucky Undershirt, and I actually did utilize this for a couple of games. I don't know. I I'm not quite sure what the best one to use is. I've been kind of going back and forth and just trying to figure out you know what is good and what isn't or maybe I'm just I have no idea really but in this second game here check out that play to start things off in the field didn't even use the bare hand we gloved it right over there to second and we are able to turn a gorgeous double play take a look at this thing one more time here as it comes off of the bat and look at Benny the Jet here in the field making plays making up for the terrible plays in the field that he had last game that was probably one of the most beautiful looking double plays that I have had in this game very excited about that one now in the top of the second a man on first base I have to make sure that I'm able to hit the ball more efficiently in this game uh, I just completely choked in the end of that last game had a couple of opportunities to potentially win the game and just wasn't able to come up with that big hit that I needed now with a man on first I'm not really expecting to drive him home here I just usually want to try and get a single maybe get him over to third potentially but I definitely do not want to strike out and right now we're down 0-2 in the count Got to try and improve on that batter's eye just a little bit. Although that one was in, so I would have probably had to swing at that one either way. But like pitches like that, that should be simple, simple, simple to hold off on. Thankfully, I did that time. So we bring it now to a 1-2 count, and it's going to be another pitch right down the middle. We drive this thing, jack it all the way out to deep center, and the center fielder comes up with it. So, I mean, it wasn't a terrible at-bat, but it definitely wasn't good enough to get any uh, on, on base or drive any runs home or anything like that. Um, I mean, it definitely could have been worse. Take a look at the outfield, by the way, right now. Look at the sky. Why is it bright red? Why am I playing in hell? I, when this was happening, I was like, what is going on? Like, is there, like, some sort of apocalyptic situation going on here in the outfield? I have no idea. That was just a, a really crazy-looking sky effect. Maybe that's something that happens at this stadium specifically, or I have no idea. Let me know if you guys have seen that before in this game, though, as we ground out here again. Ah, dang it, man. We're struggling hitting in this game right now. We definitely have to step it up as the game goes on. But, man... Playing in hell. It's definitely too hot right now. I don't know. Maybe the Jet just isn't... He isn't used to playing in hell. He's going to have to improve upon that. <laughs> All right, guys. Going for the double play here. And again, I get that same error. Trying to turn the double play. I don't think I would have been able to actually turn that one. But I don't know. That It seems kind of weird that I wasn't able to throw it over there to first base. Maybe I'm holding it too early or something. I have no idea. It, it seems really weird. I'm, I'm getting this whole MLB The Show thing back down. I don't feel like it used to be like that when I played it a couple of years ago, so they, maybe that's something that they added recently that you have to time it a little bit better than you used to, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going to have to improve on my fielding, and in this game here, we have to improve on our hitting, so we are holding off right now on these bad pitches, 3-0 count here, this is a good opportunity for us to potentially take a walk here in the top of the sixth, and right down the middle there, I probably could have smacked that thing out of the park. But I do want to force this pitcher to throw more because he's already in the high 90s for the amount of pitches that he's thrown here. And this one's going to go right down the middle. 
and we are going to ground this past the second baseman for a hit. Our runner is going to get over to third, so now we've got guys in scoring position here. Now it's my opportunity to take off and get a second guy into scoring position, and we get there with another steal. So now we have a man on second and third. Benny the Jet is doing a great job stealing bases, living up to that nickname here in the double-A system. And guys, we did eventually score one run but I didn't get home, unfortunately. So it is now the top of the eighth, down 4-5 here, down 0-1 in the count. Doesn't that guy look like that right fielder, by the way, the one that made all those errors? I wonder if there was like a glitch or something where that guy was playing in the field or something. I have no idea. He's only making his first pitch there, so this is the first batter he's faced, and we are going to smash this one to deep left center field. Can we be the hero? What? What? He caught it? I got robbed of a home run. Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Come on. That didn't look like it was going to be caught, but he did make a great play on the ball. We got bailed out on a few other opportunities, so makes sense that eventually they're going to catch one on us. We don't walk away with the win in this one, though. Hope you guys enjoyed the games. If you did, please be sure to hit the like button. Of course, subscribe if you are new, and I will talk to you guys again soon.